Is Meghan Markle blackmailing King Charles for the Princess of Wales title? Meghan reportedly has some outrageous demands hand over Princess Catherine's title and she'll consider returning to the UK with Archie and Lilibet. But that's not all. Apparently she also wants a big shiny castle and a mountain of cash. According to Royal Insiders, Meghan's latest condition for a grand return to the UK includes taking over Princess Catherine's job. The same job that involves endless duties, global attention, and of course, the title of Princess of Wales. Because what better way to re-enter the UK than by replacing the woman she's reportedly so jealous of? Royal expert Angela Levin has spilled the tea, claiming that Meghan won't return unless she gets the title and perks that come along with it. And naturally, this leaves people asking, is Meghan jealous of Princess Catherine? Levin says that Meghan's demanding not just a prestigious title, but also a big house and lots of money. What's shocking is that Meghan once complained about not being paid for royal duties. Meanwhile, Prince Harry is apparently running around seeking advice from former aides about how to make a comeback to the royal fold. It seems like things aren't going quite as planned in sunny California. All those grand dreams of independence, Netflix deals and multi-million dollar interviews must not be as fulfilling as he thought. Royal commentator Angela Levin has no patience for Harry's antics. She's called him out for wanting to play the victim while still expecting the royal family to welcome him back. According to Levin, the late Queen Elizabeth II was very clear, no half-in, half-out royals. But Harry seems to have missed that memo, still hoping to have the best of both worlds. Newsflash Harry, you can't be a part-time prince. Back to Meghan and her Princess of Wales fantasy. Is she seriously blackmailing King Charles, demanding Princess Catherine's title to make a triumphant return? According to reports, she's at least hinting at it. Angela Levin's quick to point out that Meghan's desire to replace Catherine is rooted in jealousy. Meghan's dream of becoming a global brand and influencer has hit some serious roadblocks, and now she's eyeing the one role that could give her the fame and recognition that she so craves. Let's not forget that Meghan and Harry once envisioned themselves as royalty without the boring duties, traveling the world, being adored, and influencing global politics. Meghan's love of the spotlight is no secret. While Harry seems to miss the simplicity of royal life, Meghan, according to Angela Levin, has no interest in returning to the UK without significant upgrades to her status. As for Prince William, he's reportedly not having any of it. Sources say he's already banned Harry from coming back to the royal fold, so it's safe to assume Meghan's dreams of swapping titles with Catherine won't fly either. William's laser-focused on his duties and has no time for Harry's victim routine or Meghan's absurd demands. Angela Levin also notes that Meghan's PR troubles are piling up. Losing another head of PR is just another blow to a global brand ambitions. Meanwhile, the royal staff members who've worked for decades within the monarchy continue their loyalty, making Meghan's constant employee turnover look even more suspicious. With the California project unravelling and the return to the UK blocked by royal resistance, where does this leave the dynamic duo? If Meghan can't get the Princess of Wales title and the royal lifestyle she's demanding, we can only imagine what her next move will be.